to turn themselves in. Some about a public apology. Somebody's battling cancer. They feel like they can't, they ain't gonna make it, so they might wanna make amends with you before they go. So maybe part of this is maybe that, I don't know, I'm struggling getting like colon cancer or prostate cancer or something, um, testicular cancer. I feel like it's something to do with a masculine energy. Confirmation. Um, could possibly be a Scorpio or a Leo. Don't have to be. Um, it could be a Virgo. It could be any sign, really. But they want it. somebody from your past. It is definitely a karmic person, without a doubt. They know that the reason what, what they're going through is because of what they've done to you. It's their karma. They don't. Um, they don't want to fight. They know they're about to pass away. They're trying to make some sort of amends before they go. And I feel like they're either surrendering. They're either they're going to turn themselves in because they know they're passing away anyway. They, they know it's, it's coming. All right. And I don't know if you know this. I feel like they didn't tell you this. You might intuitively know. Maybe you, you got that. Deal, I don't know. But, um, yeah. Somebody's trying to make amends. They don't want to fight. I feel like they, because they're afraid of where they're going when they leave here, they know where they're going. They're going straight to hell. Um, and, you know, I feel like they, they, they know that. They're quite clear and obvious that they're going to hell. But they're worried about what part, what level of hell they're going to. Because there's levels to hell. Okay? Just like there's levels to heaven. Um, and for the things that they have done to you and to other people... They're worried about going to the worst part of hell, which they most likely are. Um, maybe they, they got a download. Maybe they had some, some sort of, I don't know, um, epiphany that they need to make this right so that they at least raise their, their level of hell that they're going to. Um, and they're exposing this. I don't know. You might get an apology on somebody's deathbed, or they might be leaving. I don't know. They might leave... Um, an apology letter or a confession as they're passing, but I feel like there's somebody surrendering here with the hermit and the, the five of wands underneath of it in the reverse. I feel like this is some sort of surrender. Or like the authorities coming in to arrest a person and not them not putting up a fight, maybe because their health is bad and they can't put up a fight, they can't run, they can't go. But again, they're, the authorities, while they're watching you, uh, while they're investigating this whole thing, they're seeing how childish these people have been and how you just been so passive during this. You've just been not even paying no mind. You haven't been fighting back with these people. Um, you've just been worrying about yourself, focusing on yourself and what you got going on and just rapidly progressing, you know what I mean? And yeah. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, Angels, Ancestors, Love of the Past Away. Their ships ain't coming in. They're not going to... Or, no, there's two ones. I thought it was... I thought, yeah, whatever their plans were, they've been exposed. It's not happening. Because whatever they thought that... Whatever childish shit that they could have even been childish trying to get you to get locked up. They could have did some sort of false investigation. Like, like I said, that false investigation thing. Whatever they were planning for you, um, it's not happening. All right? They're very unrealistic. They're very sad, Okay? They've been exposed for whatever their plans were to come up against you. We have 2-2. Two, two. We have 7-7-6-6-2-2. Seven, seven, six, six, two, two. They don't believe in themselves or what they got going on. They just have, you know... If somebody was a seer, okay, if they had some sort of spiritual gifts, they could have lost them by coming for you. Yeah, your ships are coming in now. Whatever they thought, they know. And they know that whatever their plans were to, to, to come up against you, they've been exposed, okay? They know it. They know that the cops are coming in, the, the feds are coming in, or whoever is coming in to arrest their bitch asses. And whatever ships you got coming on is coming in. You're getting the victory, success, public, public recognition, possibly even fame. 
Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, Angels, Ancestors, and loved ones that passed away. And then look, 10 plus 2 is 12, and then 6 plus 6 is, is 12, 12, 12. You're surrounded by Ascended Masters, you know what I mean? You could be Ascended Master reincarnated. But you're like, you're way too high vibrational, way too protected for any of their childish antics to, to affect you. And whatever seeds you're planting are flourishing beautifully, just keep showing up, right? And they've been exposed for whatever their plans were, what they were investing in to come up against you. Yeah, how they're smiling in your face, stabbing you in the back to try to get some sort of victory, success, public recognition, whatever. Yeah, that's not going to happen. They made it right over top of two ones in reverse. They've been exposed for this. Yeah, they're do maybe an Aquarius. Now they're, they're paying people to like to smile on your face, stab you in the back, so that they can get some sort of like you know victory and success. But that's not happening. Their plans foiled. Okay. Very selfish. Always trying to cause some sort of problems. You know they're very anxious right now too because they realize they self sabotage themselves or whatever their plans were. And I'm strongly getting they try to get you locked up for some shit that you didn't do. They try to frame you, and they've been exposed for it. Yeah, these people with selfish energy, they were obsessed with, you know, smiling in your face, stabbing you in the back, doing you all types of dirty shit. Somebody could have some sort of addictions, it could be overindulging in drugs or alcohol, um, or any kind of, somebody's gambling their money away too, as well. They're living in complete and utter darkness. They feel like a failure, because they are. Look, five and two is seven. We have seven, seven, seven. And then, damn, six, six, six. They know that's what's coming in for them. They're going straight to hell. You realigned your, your thoughts to a higher perspective and kept moving. And now you also have somebody from your past that's starting it because they know they're, they're, they can't fight. They don't have this fight. Somebody's about to surrender or some shit because they know, again, that they're going straight to hell. Now they want to come, you know, instead of smiling their face at you in the back, they want to come, you know, do the right thing. Because they're worried about the devil coming to collect. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, Angels, Ancestors, and Loved Ones that Passed Away. What does the collective need to know? Somebody's name could begin with an S, or someone's name could be Sean. Nine of Swords. They can't sleep at night. They're scared to death. Because they know the devil's coming to collect and they know they're about to... They're, they're butthurt about being two-faced, okay? And how they're, they're, they thought this was such a great plan. For some of you, this has been going on for years. So they thought that... Um, you know what I mean? They thought that um, also six plus two, the six of wands plus the two of wands, that's like the eight of wands, right? They know that, you know, whatever they sent out to you is coming back to them. It's a backfire, and you're just rapidly progressing. You're about to get some sort of quick communication about these people that were smiling in your face, stabbing you in the back. And how they're busted, how they're caught up. Confirmation, confirmation. You're about to get there. They got some sort of quick communication about, you know... How you completed some sort of cycle and how this this cycle is being closed out. They're you know they're very hopeless. Okay, they're worried. They they're worried about being in prison, like going to prison, because they're caught up, man. You might want to cut some cords. Maybe do another cord cutting. There's a six 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 again. There's a devil again. There it is. It came back out. These people, this Scorpio or whoever this from your past, that's in this devilish energy, they'll smile in your face, stabbing you in the back. They know they're about to be going. They can't go. They can't go on anymore. 
they're living in complete and under darkness. They're trying to do some sort of like they're obsessed with smiling your face, having you in the back. They're obsessed with trying to to cause you endings and stuff. All right, they feel very powerless. They're definitely in their shadow, you know, self and 666. Yeah, somebody wants to realign their thoughts to a higher perspective and bring you some, you know, they know they've been defeated. But they're worried about, they're up on like, you know, maybe the, the devil's got a, a major hold on them. They know the devil's coming to collect. King of Pentacles. It could be a King of Pentacles that's um that can't fight no more. That's being watched by the authorities for how they have their finances and you know what I mean? Painful permanent ending. Somebody could be passed on why. It's either, you know, because they're being watched. They know. They they intuitively know it's over. Somebody's like the um, IRS is looking through their fucking finances, like with a fine tip. Uh, boom. We have five, five. It's another ten. Ten, ten. Completion, end of a cycle. Wow, they really feel like completely defeated. And then ten, ten. Yeah, completion, another end of a cycle. Ten, ten. Completion, end of a cycle. They know it's completely over for them. Maybe they're paying people to try to unalive you. It's been exposed. And like whatever this is, I feel like they have cancer or something that's very painful. They don't have the fight. They can't go on no more. They feel completely and utterly defeated. Because they are. And then another seven. So another seven, 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 seven now. And 11, 11, 5, 6, 5, uh, you know, 5, 6, and then 5, 6, it's 11, 11. Thank you, Spirit. Ace of Pentacles. In the upright. Somebody wants to apologize to you because you're for possibly stealing this Ace of Pentacles. But they didn't realize all Aces are gifts from God. They can't be stolen. They can't be taken. Even if they got their little grubby little paws on it, it was only an illusion. It's coming back to you. And not only is it coming back to you, but you're getting more than what it, what it was before you got it. All right. Whatever you're doing for work or whatever you're working on. Um, we had the high priestess with your spiritual with your spiritual gifts or whatever this is. Um, you're rapidly progressing and it's leading you to an ace of pentacles all in itself. Plus, you know, they could have stole this. I don't know, but it's coming in. Now they want to apologize to you. There's people from your past that don't want to fight with you. They want to come in and apologize because they know that you're getting this ace of pentacles. And I'm sure only getting whatever this court case is. Um, you're, you know, after you get done, everything's done and said, you're getting a huge payout from this. A generous, wow, Ace of Pentacles followed by the Six of Pentacles. A generous blessing to the point where you're able to bless other people's pockets. And the authorities know who you are. You're a very generous, loving, nurturing, caring, divine being. All right. The time is right to take um, action on your ideas. Five and one is six, so six, 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 four sixes in a row, and oh, five sixes in a row. Under judgment, yeah. Look, this King Pentacles is under heavy judgment for what they've done to you. Heavy, heavy judgment. Somebody could be throwing up. Or doing throw up magic, possibly. Fucking weird and disgusting. I just smell throw up. Two, two, two. They're under judgment. But then they've been exposed for whatever their plans were, okay?
I feel like somebody is like, yeah. This person just feels like giving up, honestly. Somebody could have took you out of the freezer if they're doing freezer spells on you. Because they realize that you're too protected and it instantly backfired on them. They're stuck in stagnant now while you're rapidly progressing. Yeah, David exposed. Look, another two. Two of swords. These people that were trying to block you, they're under heavy judgment for this. These people that you cut off. They could be trying to stall out this, um, you know, this, this, this justice, but it's not happening. You're getting your, your, you know, you're getting your justice. Look at the leaper. It's like talking about balance, okay? The, the scales being balanced. It could be a leaper that's under um, heavy judgment. I don't know. Or you could be a leaper. I don't know. Everything's being, what does I say? Everything's being balanced out for you. All right. Capricorn energy. And anybody that was juggling you, using you as an option, they're all under heavy judgment for that because you were their blessing. You know, God blessed you with them um, into their lives, okay? And they took advantage of you. They decided to treat you like shit and do everything they could to stop and block you. Yeah, everything that was done in the dark has come to light. All those lies, manipulation, all the bullshit that they've done has been exposed and they're under heavy judgment. You know? They're trying to cause some sort of illusions. Somebody could have been doing moon magic. They could have been doing death magic, some weird shit. You know, um, and anybody that was like, you know, anybody that's not in your face stabbing you back, they're all under judgment and it's going to be exposed or it already is. But I feel like you still have a snake around you that's smiling in your face stabbing you in the back, but they're under heavy judgment for this, okay? They're in grief, pain, sorrow, agony. Because what was done in the dark has come to light. Two, two plus one is three, and then two, four, six, or three, six, nine. You're manifesting. You're manifesting your justice. And they're being watched, causing all these lies, these illusions, and everything else. Somebody's secretly spying on you, smiling, smiling in your face, stabbing you in the back. They're under judgment for that as well. Somebody's doing um, remote viewing or astral projecting. They're under judgment for that, like invading your privacy and your space. Um, yeah. They could have lost that gift. This group called Coven Secret Society, this they're of devil worshippers, alright? Whatever you're doing, see how this land over top of the Ace of Pentacles? Whatever you're doing with your spiritual gifts, you know, um, is leading you to this Ace of Pentacles as well. This group called Coven Secret Society, they're all getting arrested, okay? For the childish ass, devilish ass um, shit that they've done to you. There's definitely some sort of mood magic going on here. That's backfiring. They're a bunch of devil worshippers, look at this. They were secretly, these people from your past were secretly in some group, cult, coven, secret society of darkness, alright, of, of, of complete darkness, and, you know, they're under judgment for all the lies, betrayals, everything they've done to you, you're the one that's getting this victory, success, public, public recognition, possibly even fame, another 5-5. Five, five. Uh, 
oh, they're blocked from your energy. The devil to the hierophant. They're blocked. These people from your past are completely blocked from your energy. The devil to the hierophant. That's being blocked from your energy. They're not allowed in your energy. And again, like I was saying, how they were astral projecting to you or remote viewing you, they can't do that no more. They can't, they can't even get a reading done on you. They're not allowed in your energy at all. They're completely blocked. All these people from your past, now they're in grief, pain, sorrow, agony about this too because they, they don't know what's going on. They're left in the darkness. They're, they're completely, well, they're in the darkness completely, but they're left in the dark. They don't know what you got going on. This is why you're being, you know, um, I'm highly keep guiding you to continue moving in silence because they can't even pull cards on you. They can't do anything. They're completely blocked from your, these people from your past are completely blocked from your energy. And... If they didn't, if they, if they have any, you know, any of them that, that, uh, if they did have any remote view, anything like that, they are completely blocked. They can't get in. So they're really freaking the fuck out. The only access they have is the access you give them. So like, or if like, you know, if you have, you know, YouTube or, um, social media or something, that's the only thing they get is what you allow them to see or like what you put out. But you, of course they have fake accounts and shit like that. But other than that, um... But whatever, like, you know, they, they don't know what's going on. They can't get into your energy at all. Oh, shit. Hold up, hold up. My manual. Guys, can we hit this like up, please and thank you? Please hit the like button, please and thank you. Oh, yeah. They were how they stole from you. They're being very deceit, uh, deceitful. They're being watched because they stole that inheritance. We already seen the Ten of Pentacles. You might have some sort of hidden gifts that you're unaware of. Yeah. They're a very loving, nurturing, caring, divine being. The authorities know this within, like, you know, this might be why you might have, like, you know, some an authority figure or something that wants to apologize to you because they believe the lies that were spread about you because somebody was trying to get you under some sort of false investigation. <clears throat> See my third chakra? It's not going to work. Some sort of false investigation. And <clears throat> it's not going to work. And, um, you know, they could have believed these lies, okay? And maybe this, even this group, Pole Cup and Secret Society, maybe some of them people um, might even want to apologize. I don't fucking know. But they truly know that who you are. A very loving, nurturing, caring, divine being. All right. Now they want to walk away. Someone's going to try and run from the authorities, but they're going to get caught. They're going to get beat the fuck up. Somebody also wants to walk away from being childish and, and causing you some sort of issues and like fighting with you because they know they're exposed. They know that they're being watched by the authorities. 87 can be significant. 98 can be significant. 78 can be significant. 82 can be significant. 85 can be significant. And somebody's surrendering. I'm telling you, somebody's going in. They don't want to fight no more. There's somebody surrendering. Maybe because they have health issues. I don't know. Um, they might even be thinking that this cancer or whatever this is is going to get them out of out of prison or something. Because maybe they have like a, you know. Yeah, somebody's walking. They don't want to fight. They're surrendering themselves. They don't. They don't have the fight in them. So somebody's doing the right thing. And I strongly feel like it's somebody who has cancer and they, they just don't have the fight to go on. It's making their, um, their, you know, them always have to look over their shoulder and knowing, you know, what's going on. It's making their health decline. All their stress, they can't afford this extra stress. So somebody's surrendering. It could possibly be this King of Pentacles. They're going to sur surrender themselves to the authorities because they know that they're being watched. They want to apologize and possibly give you a payment. I don't know. They might want to pay you. Maybe they're, I don't know. Pay you back what they stole from you. But they're, they're surrendering the fight. It's clear as day. Look, the, the five ones in the reverse. He's walking straight to the police. Someone's turning themselves in. And if it's not, like, maybe, okay, so maybe that, maybe they're thinking, all right, well, if they just go do this, they surrender, they turn it in, you know, you'll have mercy on their soul, and you'll, you won't press charges because their health is very bad. You know, maybe this person should just be home and, um, 
let them you know, pass away peacefully. You know what I mean? Uh, somebody also wants to say hi to you because it's H, and then I see an I right here. Or Hill could be someone's name, H-I-L-L. -L. Or somebody's running for the hills. <laughs> They're going to get caught there. Okay. But yeah, I strongly feel like there's somebody with cancer that were or some sort of really bad illness, they just don't have no fight in them. They're surrendering. Um, that'd be the best thing to do, okay? They should just turn themselves in. We have five, uh, two plus one is three, plus five is eight, so eight, eight. They're turning themselves in, they're surrendering. Um, and they might be surrendering abundance, okay, and prosperity, this, this money that they stole from you. Um, I mean, if I was you, if they're actually turning themselves in and being a man or a woman, and their health is really bad, I wouldn't press charges on this person, okay? You're getting back what's yours. Let this person just pass. Um, you know, depending on what state you're in, the authorities, the state might pick up these charges, but this person's health is really, really bad. They're not, they, they know they're, they're not gonna, they're not gonna be here much longer. And they're only doing it because they, they don't have the fight in them. They could really be on bed rest, possibly. They could be on hospice. I don't know. But I wouldn't be cold-hearted. I wouldn't do that. Like, I wouldn't, you know, lower your sword for that. Like, let the person, for, you know, pass in peace. But that's if they turn themselves in. You know what I mean? If they don't if they don't surrender, then fuck them. Like, then, you know what I mean? But if they're trying to make it right into, on their last bed, you're, you know, on their deathbed, I would just let the person, I would just let them roll, okay? You're going to get back what's yours and let them go in peace, you know, because they are going to hell after, after all. So, you know what I mean? And I feel like that's what's happening here. But the state might pick up the charges. If you're in a commonwealth uh, state, the, the state will pick up the charges. Yeah, they're, they're surrendering what they stole from you. They're very stagnant, okay? They feel bad for being so, you know, for betraying you. They have a very low self-esteem. Mm-hmm. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, Angels, Ancestors, Love and Past Away. What does the collective need to know? I find I really feel bad for this person. Like I really do. I really just don't have it. Yo. Look. Imprisonment. Eight is the eight of swords. They're turning themselves in, they're going to jail. And then 888, Abundance of Prosperity. Yeah, somebody's surrendering. Maybe they already did. But the Eight of Swords, yeah, they're walking straight into, into the courthouse. Alright, um, to turn themselves in. Or maybe they came and got arrested. Maybe they came to their house and they couldn't fight. They couldn't run. They went in without a, without a fight, possibly. Either they turned themselves in, they walked straight into the police and, and turned themselves in. Or the feds came or whoever came to their house. They're on bed rest or something. Or they're just like, ill and they, they went in without a fight. There's somebody in jail, too, that maybe has a health concern that, I don't know... Yeah, they could have came to their house, okay? They could have came, and then we had the, somebody could have been on house arrest, and maybe the, the cops came and arrested them, or this was going to happen, but maybe they stole a house from you, too. That could have been it, too. Somebody's walking away from a solid foundation. They're going in, surrendering themselves, or the cops came to the house, and or they were on house arrest already, or maybe, okay, maybe give this person house arrest. Maybe they, they're hoping if they go turn themselves in and surrender what they stole, that they'll they'll get house arrest instead because they are their health is extremely bad you know what i mean um maybe they'll be able to pass you know do their time at home on house arrest on you know you know on um i just heard life support oh shit yeah i would really let this person pass at home Could be an Aries, possibly, or it could be a Pisces, or you could be any of these signs. The 
There's some here about a house arrest. Maybe that's what they're going to get since they're turning themselves. Maybe their lawyer told them, like, look, go, go surrender. Um, and you have some people that are running for the hills, okay? But there's, um, they're going to get coy. Uh, but there is somebody here that's surrendering, okay? And I feel like they're going to get, if anything, they're going to get, like, house arrest. Yeah, that's what their goal is. Their goal is to go surrender and hope that, you you know, you and the, and the justice system has mercy on their soul and let them pass at home. And you get back whatever, you know, was taken from you. And someone's name could definitely be a hill. Last name could be a hill. Something about a house on the hill. Because they're losing out on opportunities, okay? They have no more opportunities, you know? They have nowhere else to go, so they have they, they, they have nowhere else to run. They, they, and they have no fight in them, so they're just surrendering. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, Angels, Ancestors, Little Pathway. What is, everything's being balanced out, yeah. Everything's being balanced out, they're going in. They know everything's been exposed, they know everything's being balanced out for you. Um, they don't want to be childish no more. So they're going, they're surrendering themselves. Or they did, I don't know if they did or not, or if they are going to. And you're getting a solid love offer, possibly from a Capricorn, or you could be a Capricorn, or a Leo, or an Aries, or an Aquarius, possibly. Don't have to be, it could be a Pisces. Two plus three is five, 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 five again. A bunch of fives, you're on the right path. They want to take the right path, okay, five, five, five. They want, you know, they want to take the, the high road. And somebody's in a mental prison about this. And maybe this is somebody that was that came in. This could be an ex of yours that's surrendering themselves. That was smiling in your face, stabbing you in the back. That was being really two-faced with a Gemini here. That came in with a false cup of love, all right? Um, that's, maybe that's the person that's surrendering themselves. But they know everything's being balanced out for you. You're getting a solid love, um, love offer coming in. You're getting victory, success, public recognition, possibly even fame. Because your person knows the truth about who was smiling in their face, stabbing them in the back as well. Oh, 8 plus 2 is 10. So 10, 10 again. Another 10, 10. Another 10, 10. Completing out a lot of cycles. Closing and, um, and completing cycles. Yeah, your ships are coming in, right? Express your creativity, 